Take a look at this. A massive tree came down on the plaza. This is near Central Avenue. This is the second tree to come down in the same block in less than 24 hours. Meteorologist Chris Mulcahy picks up our team coverage from Cornelius where trees are down there as well. And Chris, we saw earlier this morning a tree actually fell onto a boat. Yeah, this is incredible, Rob. So I'm right next to this very, very large oak tree, but look at the bottom here. It took up some of the walking tiles and also some of this wooden guard, but this also shows what oak trees can do. Oak trees are very shallow rooted trees, so when you get the big wind gusts, especially when they're super top heavy like this one, that's what you're going to see. Meanwhile, in the neighbor's yard, these are three cedar trees that fell as a domino effect. So that one also uprooted that buckled the fence over in the neighbor's yard toppled one on top of another but you mentioned the boat underneath this very large oak tree you can see the boat here now the sad thing about this is the owner just bought this boat two days ago two cars also were underneath these cedar trees luckily there was only minor damage right now the owner's trying to cut them out so they can go about their business for the day but this is one of the largest trees i've seen one more second Stuart. show them the top of the tree you can see just the top of the tree by pure magnitude is taller than the house itself. So even though there is some damage here, it could have been a whole lot worse. Everyone is safe. They slept through the night. However, this did wake them up. I'm meteorologist Chris Mulcahy reporting here. Cornelius, back to you.